girl called Sophie. And one day Sophie left her school like every day and she walked home. But for some strange, strange reason she decided to go home a different way. Mm -hmm. After walking a little way home she saw a small girl crying. Sophie asked her what the problem was and she said that she had lost her cat her cat had gone into a big big house <clears throat> but the little girl was too frightened to go inside after the cat Sophie was very very kind and decided to help the little girl find the cat they got to the front of the house. The door was already opened. There was no one home. When they walked in the door, suddenly a slime behind them. But Sophie decided to, to help the little girl to look for the cat anyway. They saw the cat on the stairs and decided to go after it. Sophie and the little girl followed the cat. They walked up to the top of the stairs and when they got there, they saw the cat staring at them. It was like the cat was waiting for them. But just as they were about to pick up the cat, it jumped and ran away from them into an open bedroom. They went inside the bedroom. The bedroom was a little girl's bedroom. Everything was pink except the dolls. The dolls were everywhere staring at them. The dolls were so creepy. Sophie felt very very scared. Suddenly in the corner of the room a rocking horse started moving all on its own. Sophie started to feel very bad. She wanted to go home. She decided to turn around and leave when she saw a photo of a family. A father, a mother and a little girl. And a little girl looked just like the little girl who had lost her cat. They killed me! And now they are going to kill you! <laughs> the next day... The next day... <laughs> Sophie was never, ever seen again. She had disappeared. But every Halloween night, if you look out from your window, you will see the ghost of, the, of Sophie staring at you from the garden in the night. <laughs> Go away and be careful with Sophie's gun. Go away.